So I'm making one of my go-to harvest meals, my chorizo and tot breakfast burritos. They are hot, melty, and meaty. Truly the ideal handheld situation. I'm starting with one of the most important parts, the tots, and I'll bake them for a really long time so that they get extra crispy. Like, ignore what the package says. No offense to the package, but you wanna get them super, super, super crispy so that they hold up in the center of the burrito and they don't risk getting soggy. I'll season with a little salt and pepper, and then I'll bake at 425 degrees for 30 minutes until they're dark brown and crisp. While the tot's crisp, I'll cook up my chorizo. I've got a skillet here heating over medium-high heat. I'll add a drizzle of oil. I've got eight ounces of pork chorizo here, which is smoky, a little spicy, and so, so flavorful. And I'll break it up with my spoon into little pieces as it cooks. As this finishes up cooking, I'll chop up an onion, get more flavor in there. I'll stir this around and allow the onion to soften. I kind of like a breakfast burrito that's been sitting around for half an hour because everything melts and steams together. Mmm. The onion is soft and the chorizo is fully cooked. I'll remove it from the heat. Just set it aside in my bowl. I'll wipe out my skillet because I'll use this to cook the eggs too. I'll return the pan to the heat. I've got shredded mozzarella, which is super melty and it's mild, so it allows the chorizo to shine and my big flour tortillas. All right, so to cook this, this is a really fun method. I'll add a drizzle of oil to my pan, a quarter of the chorizo and onion mixture, and then I'll pour in enough egg to cover the surface of the pan. These are just beaten with salt and pepper. I'll tilt it so it goes all the way to the edges. I'll sprinkle with cheese. And I love using mozzarella here. It's melty, it's mild. And then the cheese and the egg, which hasn't fully set yet, will help glue on the tortilla. Before the egg fully sets, I'll press the tortilla on. And I should mention that I'm doing this in a non-stick skillet, which makes everything easier. I'll brush the top of the tortilla with a thin layer of oil. Once the egg is fully set on the bottom, and I know that by wiggling the pan and it's no longer sticking to the pan, it's ready to flip. So I'll get under here with my fish spat and swiftly, I'm gonna commit, flip it. Dun, da, da, da. I'll allow the tortilla to get golden crisp on the bottom. I love the way that the tortilla gets lightly fried. Now that the tortilla has some brown color on it, oh, it looks good. I'll slide it out of the skillet, grab my tap, those are beautiful. And then pile tots right onto the center. Drizzle of sriracha. And then I'll roll this up to a tight little package. Oh, yeah, that looks so good. But I need the sauces first. Gotta have salsa. I love tomatillo salsa with this because it's so bright. And then I figure if we're having tots, let's just go all in and have ranch on the side as well. Ready for this cross section? Ready for this crunch? Oh yeah. Mmm, that looks good. Oh yeah, now we're talking. Here I go. Mmm, -hmm. it's got all the food groups. Meat, cheese, eggs, tots, and ranch. I'm in breakfast burrito bliss.